大家好 ，This video let's talk about when Hui and Yao is predicting the future event or action. As we know in Chinese, both Hui and Yao can express future actions or event, and they can be translated as will or going to. For example, I will going to Beijing next week. In Chinese, we can say 下周我会去北京。下周。我要去北京 In these two sentences, Hui and Yao could interchangeable. But if I say the movie is going to start, in Chinese we only use Yao here. 电影要开始了 Cannot say 电影会开始 So if you are struggling with this usage, let's find out a way to clear it up. I summarize the difference in terms of internal factors, subjective intentions, and how close or far the event is from the present. When something might happen, but you are not entirely sure, and you making a guess based on the internal fact, we usually use Hui, such as 天气变冷了，明天。会下雪 Here, I am making a guess that snow tomorrow, based on the fact that 天气变冷了 is getting colder. But at the time of speaking, I am not hundred percent sure if will really snow. On the other hand, if you are quite certain something will happen, and、uh, there is a strong subjective feeling or plan behind it, we use 要要下雨了，快回家。In this context, a feeling is going to rain. I'm making a strong prediction based on the change I see in the clouds. At the time of speaking, I'm pretty sure it's going to rain. Another pair of examples: 妈妈，我会吃饭。你不要再说了。I will eat dinner. 我会吃饭 is something that might happen, but at the time of speaking, I'm not hundred percent sure if I'm actually eat it. Personally, it's cause mom keep nagging me to eat. I'm getting annoyed. 十二点了，我要去吃午饭。Going to have lunch. 要去吃午饭 is something the speaker is almost certain will happen. It's plan that the speaker has already decided, and is pretty much guaranteed. When something is going to happen but is still far from the present, we usually use Hui, such as 天气预报说明天会下雨。下个月我朋友会来我家。明天我会去旅游。要 often imply the event is close to happening. And the action will take place soon or even immediately. Let's see the examples. 火车要开了，你快点儿。Maybe the train will leave in three minutes. 要刮大风了，快把窗户关上。By the time I'm speaking, it might already been getting windy. 我要回家了，再见。Right after I say this, I probably going to leave. So that's it for today. I hope my explanation help you understand a bit more about the difference between 会 and 要明白了吗 See you next time.